Okay, hello guys, welcome to this new video. Before I start though, I do want to say I apologise for the laptop being there and that's just got the questions for this video on. So that's why that's there, just so I can improvise it and just let you know my thoughts. Just because then I feel like it'll be a more honest opinion if I don't overthink it. And secondly, ignore, can you just sort of partially ignore the background because I'm in process of like getting stuff to put on this wall and I'm changing the top shelf up there. The finished stuff will probably stay unless I get some more. But yeah, so just can you also let me know your thoughts about this new backdrop? Because I can always put stuff like what I'm about to watch. There is sort of just something more visible to see. But yeah, just to let me know your thoughts on this new backdrop. Because for the foreseeable future, this will be how I'll film, film probably the majority of my videos. So yeah. Let's just get into the video. This video is basically um, the Doctor Who tag sort of thing. With me and like someone else, Millie the Whovian, which check it out. Her link will be in the description, which I'll talk more about her channel at the end. But yeah. So this is like the Doctor Who tag. And uh, I've just got a ton bunch of questions here. That's why that drops there. And I'll be answering them. So the first one's my favourite doctor. Honestly, my favourite doctor. It's close. So I've looked through the odd question, I haven't seen them all. My favourite doctor's close between like the third, fifth, sixth, seventh sort of doctor. Then four probably up there, but I'd probably give a slight edge to the third doctor. Yeah, but let's go with that. And then I'll well, I'll do classic and modern for these questions if I can. So my favourite modern doctor is David Hannon, my first doctor. On mention to Christopher Eccleston though, if he had more episodes he would undoubtedly be my favourite. Wasn't my first, David Hannon was, but he would be my favourite if he had more episodes. So favourite companion is a few as well. There's like Jane McQuiggan, Joe Grant, Nissa. Honestly, I'd say Jamie and Joe Grant and Ace, them sort of three. Yeah, I'll go with them. As my favourite companions. All pretty decent companions. Yeah, so for the modern era, it's harder. I'm not even going to go with Martha Jones. Because she's probably not what you expect. I personally love Martha. She's a great character. She had more development in the three part of right at the end of the series Utopia, Sam Jones, Lost the Time Watch, the Rose had in two series. And Donna, yeah, I liked her, but I was not as big a fan of her as some people. So yeah, let's go Martha. And then, favourite villain. So yeah, I would, there's quite a few, there's like Solovians, Isles, and Tarlins are definitely up there. Obviously Cybermen, Daleks, the Master. I'd probably go with... Maybe the Ice Wolf, well any of them three, Zontara and the Ice Wolf Silurians, just because they're not, I don't want to say the Zontara, no the Daleks or Sidemen because they're the obvious ones. So yeah, next is least favourite villain. That's so sort of hard to think of, because you don't really think of your least favourite villains. I can't think of it off the top of my head. Nope, definitely can't. So because you're not really stuff you think about your least favourite winner. So I'll just say John Sims incarnation of the Master, I guess. Because I really don't like that version. The Master's a character is amazing, just that specific version isn't great. Favourite special. I would go with Times of Midnight as a crew special. Probably the best. Maybe all by televised versions. It would be between three. Twice Upon a Time, the new one. Uh, Voyage of the Damned and The Next Doctor. I like all three of them. They are some amazing specials. And um, probably the only three I actually like. Along with the Chris with Amazing, but that's just slightly below one. So yeah, they're the, they're the four sets I like, and those are the three that would be like, my favourites. Favourite season? 
probably series, season 7 on the classic Eva. The saddest moment, Ardwick's death in Earthstock. One of the best done deaths, I like the silent credit scene. Just one of the best done departures in classic Who. Um, funniest moment, the entirety of the Romans episode. Because that is probably one of the few episodes that made me laugh. So the, that episode was just a very comedic episode. I'd probably get the majority of that episode. Um, Favourite quote? Um, there's quite a few. There's Science Leads. I liked that one. There's Books, Greatest Weapons in the World. Both of them the modern era, to be honest. There are probably two I would go with. How many? I think too many. Um, scariest villain, probably the Weeping Angels. I'm gonna go with favorite ships. Um, Barbara and Ian. I guess that means relationships or romantic. I suppose I'll go with Barbara and Ian. It's just like a non-love story, which is what I like about it. Like they aren't, it's not so in your face saying these, these two are in love. It's like you see the bit of flirting, but it's no in your face. And you know they probably were together now, well, in continuity sort of thing. So I don't know, Big Finish could have done that, which I haven't seen every Big Finish. You can see by the lack of stuff there. Least favourite, obviously it's going to be Rose and the Doctor. Really did not like that. Was happy once he left in Doomsday. Um, favourite actor? I think Peter Capaldi is probably the best actor. Not one of my favourite doctors. He's very low down if you rank him. But him and John Hurt are probably the two best actors to play the doctor. Actress? Um, Elizabeth Lake. Same thing about this quality show. Favourite writer? John Dorney, Matt Pitton from Big Finish. There's some really writers, very consistent. Favourite alien? I'm going to go with the same answer as Favourite Billings, that sort of see them as similar sort of questions. So, some time and Ice Warriors and Silonians. The sassiest character? Donna Noble, I'm going to guess. The most badass character? Probably Ace, because the Dalek baseball bat sort of scene. How do you most like me? Luke Smith from the Save Jane Adventures? Because yeah, you know him, you probably know what I mean. Just so, because he's also around my age. Um, Carrie, do you'd like to see again? That you're able to come back. Joe Grant, Sophie Aldred, well, Ace. Joe Grant, Ace, or Captain Jack? Um, Favourite theme song? Right. Oh, and you don't really distinguish between them all, so I'm just going to leave that one because I normally see them all as sort of a similar thing. Well, actually, no, I'd probably go for the like 60s, the original, over the modern version. Favourite catchphrase? Alonzi. Favourite gadget? Um, just Sonic Screwdriver. I wouldn't pick the Sonic Shades and I can't really think of too many off the top of my head. Favourite episode ever? Uh, I'll go for like Modern, Classic and Big Finish, just because they're the three main ones. So Inferno on TV. From the Classic Era. From the Modern Era, well I'll go Big Finish. Big Finish will be Master. And then from the Modern Era, would be Heaven Sent, Blink, sort of something like that. The most annoying character, Rose Tyler, Carl Oswald. Favourite season finale? I gather they mean my modern hooks of the build up. <laughs> it's classic who doesn't really distinguish between the finale or distinguishable. That's finales. I'll probably go for um, 
the soul nerd series end just because like my childhood was the David Tennant era so that sort of was the culmination of his whole era far better than the end of times the only thing I liked about the end of time was the final sequence with everyone I didn't like the rest of the episode Cara do you like yeah. when I started watching Doctor Who probably back in 2007 sort of yeah I'd say, just because around Series 3, which I'm guessing was about 2006-7, maybe or maybe 8, well not 8, because that would have been done on over season. So yeah, 2007-ish. So this was sort of the Doctor Who tag. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I'd want to give a shout out to Millie the Whovian. Her channel's linked down below. Go subscribe to her, and because she does sort of convention themed videos I've only been around for like 5 months and got about 48 to 5 so we'll just try and give her a few more but yeah so if you like conventions or anything like that go check them out and also before I end can you let me know what you think of the background because the top shelf I'm going to change behind these two I'll be changing and I'm not sure I'll be probably be just in this yeah, let me know what I think and obviously I'll be just in all this yeah let me know your thoughts about this and comment down below and all that so thoughts on how I can improve this anything like that and yeah subscribe to me Lily Hoovian so I hope you all enjoyed watching and I will see you guys